So I've been seeing a ton of comments where people tell me to search up dirty on Roblox. Oh my god, dirty on Roblox. I have no idea what I'm going to find when I search up dirty, but what I'm going to do for this episode is I'm going to search up dirty. I'm going to join some of the games that pop up when you search up dirty. I'm going to talk to some of the people in these games, see why they're playing these games, and just explore all around the dirty side of Roblox. Ugh. Thank you for this weird video idea. Ugh, weirdos. Okay, we're on Roblox right now. Uh, okay, D-I-R-T-Y. Oh my gosh, Dirty Games pops up. Dirty Hangout, Dirty Place. Let's just search up Dirty. I don't even wanna look. Oh, I don't wanna look, 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 I don't wanna look but I have to. Hell no. Hell no. These games. So the first thing that pops up is Cabin Roleplay. I've played that before. Ugh, ugh. But H and D, what does that mean? Sussy vibe, what does that mean? Do not join dirty. And this one really caught my eye. Why does Twilight Daycare pop up when you search up dirty? Why does a daycare game pop up? have to explore this. We're gonna join Sussy Vibe Hangout. But before we do that, this video is sponsored by Krunker. So you know on my channel, normally I play bad games, but Krunker is a good game. So Krunker is a unique first person shooter game that's fully customizable. It's a first person shooter game that has thousands of user created maps, tons of guns, tons of game modes, tons of skins, tons of everything. What makes Krunker even better is that they have user created mods, like this Call of Duty mod that is awesome. It makes Krunker look like Call of Duty. There's tons of more mods you can download for free. The thing that also makes Krunker amazing is that you can play this game virtually anywhere. You can play it on your grandma's old Windows XP computer on the web browser. You can play it on Facebook Instant Play. You can play it on Steam. You can play it pretty much anywhere. You can use the marketplace to buy and sell different items. You can also create your own items, put them on the marketplace, and you can earn Krunkies by selling these items. So what Krunkies are is it's basically the game's currency like in Call of Duty where you have COD points, kind of like that. But with these Krunkies, you can buy skin spins and with the skin spins, you can spin and hopefully get an awesome, awesome skin. What I'm trying to say here is that there's so much to do. You can mod the game, you can play like normal, you can buy skins, you can upload new skins, you can explore people's skins, you can level up, you can go through the battle pass, you can do so many things from a web browser if you want. You don't have to even download it. They also just released season six at the end of November, so they're always updating the game. This is an awesome new game for you to play for completely free. So if you wanna stop watching me play horrible games and go play a good game for yourself, you can click the link in the description and start playing Krunker today. Are you sus? Hang out with new people. Oh my gosh, so this is probably one of those games where you just hang around, you just talk to people and you, you you do some sus stuff. I don't do sus stuff. All right, we're in the game. So this game doesn't have voice chat, so that's kind of a good thing. I hate when I hear people on voice chat talking to each other. If you hate this place because it's dirty, get the mop and clean it up. Okay, bet. What's happening? If you go in here and you press R? Whoa! Oh my gosh! This game has a soccer... Why am I Among Us character? This game has so many things. They have anime cinema, they have sussy wood, they have sussy hotel. There's a girl right here. Let's let's see what she says if I talk to her. She's level nine, she's dancing. Can I synchronize? Dance? Oh, I'm dancing! I'm an Among Us character dancing. Let's say hi to this girl. Let's see if she's one of those online daters. Okay, the girl just left after I said hi. All right. Oh my gosh, this girl just got into a car. All right, I'm gonna jump in the car with her. Whoa! Oh my God! I'm in the car! Oh, what the f I'm in her engine! Help! I'm in this girl's engine! Okay, I made it out, cool. Before we get uh, banned from this game, I wanna explore this sussy hotel. If we go in here, oh my gosh, there's a girl right there. We just snuck into a girl's hotel room. I'm going in her bathroom. She doesn't know I'm here. What type of shampoo she got? She got uh, Tresemme. Okay, that's nice. And then she got Tresemme. Okay, nice. Ugh! Flush the toilet, you... Y'all are gross. Bro, this is a fake girl. His Roblox username is Carter. Have you ever met a girl named Carter? What's in this room? Number seven? Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh, there's a lot of people. <laughs> this girl has no clothes on. Do you see... Oh my gosh. He just said, follow me. And then she's following him. The girl with no clothes is about to follow him. 
Oh my gosh, they went into room number three. He shut the door. Okay, let's give him some time. I can't open it. He locked it. What is this dude doing with his banana? You know what I'm gonna do? I'm gonna go out of this game with a bang. Right here. Oh! Oh! I also forgot to mention that after we play each of these games, I'm gonna rate each one on a scale of 1 to 100 on the turbo scale based on how bad they are. If they're bad, they get a low rating. If they're good, they get a high rating. I'm gonna give that sussy vibe game a 2 out of 100. Okay, let's join this H and D game. It has like a fire emoji. It's got 14 people playing right now, so hopefully we can talk to these people. The picture is just an emoji. That's all. Welcome to H and D. Okay, play. I do not want to be seen in these games. People are going to think I'm a weirdo, dude. All right, I'm in the game. This game has voice chat. This game has voice chat. Oh my god. This dude said, girl, you look nice. And she said, thank you? He said, what are you even doing in this game? All you do is stand. Bro, why is he talking? Bro's level 86. Why are you talking? Hey, can you come over here? Just like follow sure. me real quick. Yeah. Yeah, come over here. Okay. And get in that corner right there. Nah, you do it. And get in that corner. You do it. And get in that corner. All right, bum. That H and D game definitely gets a one out of 100. There was nothing to do in that game, and I found some weirdos. But look at this. There's a game that says new, dirty game with a winky face. There's one person playing right now. There's actually one person in this game. So let's try to join before they leave and ask them why they're joining these games by themselves. Okay, we're in and 76 strikers is in the game. Let's type to him. Oh, he left. Ah, da, 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 da. He saw the sign said, LOL, kid. And he left, bro. I'm gonna give that game a 50 out of 100. It was pretty cool because it was actually a joke. It wasn't actually a dirty game. It was just a game where they were gonna troll people who joined. So that's awesome. But I found something that isn't awesome. Do not join dirty. There's three people in this game right now. What could these three people be doing to each other? This, this dude's been typing. He said, what's up? Hi, hi. How old are you? Let me see that ad. What? Hey, yo, I'm 13. What the fuck? He's been in this game for 586 seconds. I did the math in my head. That's two months that he's been in this game. He's just sitting in this game for two months waiting for girls to join. They even have a statue for somebody who spent more than 18 hours in this game. That, he is not a legend. That dude's a creep. So that game gets a three out of 100. It was, it was weird, man. They were, there was people in that game that were playing it for like, ugh. Now, I didn't want to join this game, but it's the first game that pops up when you search up dirty. It's cabin roleplay. And it's funny because normally when you search up a word, the first games that pop up are the games that include the word like dirty hangout should pop up first because I searched up dirty cabin roleplay doesn't even have dirty in the name and it's the first game to pop up so you know this game is dirty even Roblox knows that this is dirty we're gonna join cabin roleplay man we're gonna talk to some people trying to be dirty with each other this is about to be bad Oh my gosh, there's a girl on the ground. What the fuck? What are you guys doing? This girl is like listening to you. Are you watching YouTube videos? You should watch DJ Loves Turbo YouTube videos. Okay, this game is called Cat Girl Hangout. There's two people playing it right now. This pops up when you search up dirty. There's two people playing right now. Oh, it's just me and the dude. I, I typed to this dude and I said, why are you playing this? Somebody else just joined. I'll even add his name to it. Baller, why are you playing it? He just sent seven hashtags. What did he say? What What's a bad word that has seven letters? He said, I'm not baller. This dude is just trying to join. This dude joined a nasty game. It just kicked me out. Huh? I just got, I just got banned? Roblox does not permit spamming in the form of clickbait. What? I just got banned. I'm never playing that again. I hate baller. Okay, uh, I think it's time to go. If you want to see me search up girl on Roblox, it was really, really weird as well. You can click right there or you can click right here to unsubscribe from my stupid channel. I just got banned, bro.